Good morning, Britain. How are you? I hope you'll be all fine and uh, safe. Please keep you at home and listen to me in this uh, uh, part three for uh, solving revision sheet for the third quarter. Uh, we're going to start from uh, what we finished last session. It's number 24. He's telling you to add or subtract. Add or subtract. Of course, we're going to add or subtract according to the sign of the term. The sign of the term. Here, this sign is negative, this positive, this negative and positive, and that's so on. What we're going to do here, I'm going to take the uh, like terms together. I'm going to take the like terms together. What's the like terms here? I have here, if I have M, M like term, do you remember the like term? Same symbol, same power. Same symbol, same power. Here I have M and M, power 1 and power 1. So I'm going to take them together. Okay, again, same symbol, same power. Like terms, same symbol, same power. And here, m power 4 and I'm going to take this m power 4 and don't forget you must take each term but with its sign with its what with its sign so I have here negative 10 m plus negative 13 m okay so negative 10 and negative 13 is negative 23 very good negative 23 m and here, positive 2m power 4 minus 20m power 4. So 2 minus 20, it will give me negative 18. So negative 18m power 4. Very good. Which answer is A? Okay. I have here also at, uh, again, what we're going to do? We're going to have the common the like terms we're going to get to have the like terms what's the like terms here hmm. we said the like term is same symbol and same power same symbol and same power i have here what ah c to the power of five i'm going to c to the power of five together and here negative c so c to the power of one i'm going to take plus 7 to the c to the power of 1 and this number is just by itself there's no like term to it so let's see here hmm. 5c to the power of 5 plus 1 there is no here nothing here means 1 1c to the power of 5 so 5 plus 1 5 plus 1 is what 6 very good so 6c to the power of 5 very good negative 1 nothing means 1 Negative 1c plus c, if a negative 1 plus 7, negative 1 plus 7 equals what? 6 plus 6, very good. And the negative 2 alone is here alone. So which one? It's, the answer is hmm, d. Very good. Let's continue. Subtract. Oh, Ah, do you remember how to subtract? Huh? Of course. You tell me, yes, miss. I, I know, I remember. This negative will go inside the bracket. So it will change all the terms. This positive, it will be negative. And this positive, it will be negative. And this positive, uh, this negative, it will be positive. Okay? So, here, I take the negative and get it inside. And put instead of it, plus. So the first here is negative, and the positive will be negative, and the negative will be positive. Then what I'm going to do, I'm going to take the like terms, the like terms. Do you remember the like terms? Like terms, same symbol, same power, same symbol, same power. Huh? Same symbol and same power here. 8 b to the power of 4 and negative b to the power of 4. So 8 minus 1, we said negative without anything here, means 1. 8 minus 1 is 7. Very good. Of course, don't forget the b power 4. Hmm. Next, uh, b to the power of 3. 
negative b to the power of 3 and negative 4b to the power of 3. The both sign are the same, so add them. Hmm. 1 and 4 is 5 with negative. So negative 5b to the power of 3. And the 4, there is nothing like the 4. So it will be by itself. Okay? So my answer is 7b power 4 minus 5b power 3 plus 4, which is a. Okay? Excellent grade 9. Complete with me. Number 27. Multiply. Now we are going to multiply. Remember how to multiply grade 9? Hmm. All this term will multiply with the two terms. Here, it will get inside the bracket with here and this one. So I'm going to make what? 9x power 4, y, uh, y power 5 times this. 9 times negative 5 is negative 45. Very good, negative 45. x power 4, x power 3 times what I'm going to do with the powers. I'm going to add them to add them. So 4 plus 3 is 7. Look here, negative 45, x power 7, which is d. You don't need even to complete it, okay? But let's complete it. Hmm. Y power 5 times Y power 3. Hmm. Pa times, I'm going to add the powers. 5 plus 3 is 8. That's right. Now, we're going to take all this term times this term. 9 times negative 3. Huh? Negative 27. Excellent. X power 4 and no X here. So I will put X power 4. Y power 5 times Y power 3. Hmm. What I'm going to do with the powers? Times, add the power. If it's times, add the power. 5 plus 3 is 8. That's right. So this is my answer. Excellent. Excellent grade 9. Here, multiply. I have two, more, two binomial. Do you remember how to do binomials? We have many ways. Many ways. Okay? You can use it. Uh, but we we said this uh, way in our class how we're going to take the first term with the whole bracket the second bracket and the second term with the second bracket again here n times n minus 1 then negative 5 times n minus 1 okay so it will be what hmm, n times n n power 2 n times negative 1 it will be negative n negative 5 times n negative 5 n Negative 5 times negative 1 is 5. Now, taking the uh, same, uh, the, sa the like terms, same symbol, same power. It's n and the power is 1. Add them. Negative 1 and negative 6 is negative, uh, sorry, negative 1 and negative 5 is negative 6. Okay? So, n power 2 minus 6n power, uh, plus 5. This is my answer. Let's check it here. Which one here? It's C. Very good. Excellent grade 9. Here I have multiply and he give you a, a, a bracket power 2. You can do it with multi ways. One of you will tell me, miss, I'm going to make this bracket times itself. And I'm going to solve it like the last problem do it it's right one of you will tell me no miss i remember the rule do you remember the rule huh what does the rule tells me hmm if i have a plus b power 2 so a power 2 how can i i uh, simplify this bracket hmm how can i make it it will be a first power 2 second power 2 Plus 2 times first times second. Remember? Again. First power 2. Second power 2. 2 times first times second. Huh? Okay? Remember it? Okay. So, if you know the rule, do it with the rule. This is the first method. If you don't know how to make this bracket, you're going to make it times itself without power 2. 6w plus 6z times 6w plus 6z. And do it. Okay? So, 
6 w power 2 is 36 w power 2 6 z power 2 36 z power 2 then 2 times 6 times 6 it will be 72 and w times z is wz so my answer is c my answer is c so easy one okay here just the the second way that i told you you're going to make the bracket times itself okay i'm going to do what as as, as you like here first time first then first time second mm. second time uh, first second time second okay then you are going to take the like terms together here you will have the middle term okay just the same like the uh, the uh, other one same answer of course uh, here multiply and he give you a bracket with power 2 which one you are going to use with the rule or like this the, you are going to repeat uh, the the bracket by itself two times which which one you are going to use let's use the rule let's use the rule huh? first power two first power two so it's b power two second power two negative eight power two so it will be 64 okay two times first time second two times b times negative eight so it will be negative 16 b where is the answer here check it it will be d excellent grade nine grade nine try to solve the problems that we solve together with to get, uh, today together by yourself and you have any question please comment or tell me your uh, problem i'm going to explain it again for you uh, i'm going to uh, complete your sheet next time uh, see you please keep staying in home at home uh, and keep safe okay thank you very much this is Mr. Randa Wahida while I was with you. Thank you very much.